Johnny here, guys! And today we're talking about HD Zero goggles. Not these ones, but these ones. This is a new Emacs budget HD Zero goggle that comes in at only $239.99. What a value! And you know what's significant about these? The screen comes off, dudes! So this is totally not just a goggle, but it's also a delicious field monitor. Whoa! The simple box goggle comes in at less than half the price of the HD Zero goggles at only $239. But instead of only being an attractive beginner option, the screen can pop off, held in place by magnets. In magnets, how do they work? To become an excellent HD field monitor, up to now, you could only get budget analog goggle offerings, but as more and more users transition to digital, higher resolution, and higher quality video feeds, there has formed a gap in the budget entry range. This goggle takes that gap. The screen is where the fan and all the electronics are contained. One side has an SD card slot for monitoring and recording DVR footage and an update port while the other side has a USB-C that's used to charge the onboard battery making it the most elegant portable offering to date. Smaller and nicer than the Ishin Monigo analog monitor that I normally keep with me. It's easily pocketable. It can slide into any spot in your flight bag being able to watch when other people fly or just hand a monitor off to a spectator who may stop by to see what flying drones is all about is the key between sending someone walking away thinking your buzzing toys are annoying and putting them in the cockpit of your aircraft giving them a story to tell at dinner about the new technological milestone they were able to witness first hand you need a field monitor not just to watch but to be a good ambassador of fpv emacs has long been a manufacturer of beginner friendly gear but this is the first time they've nailed a product line that fits a new user and an experienced pilot with its dual functionality it may be notable that with its dual antenna setup instead of four like the hd0 vrx and hd0 goggles the reception may not be quite as good Good, but that is part of what allows them to manufacture this product at such an attractive price. An analog receiver would have been nice as well, but to date no product other than the $600 Event VRX has that type of dual receiver technology and that solution isn't exactly portable. For any new HD0 user, I'd say this is a better offering for beginner goggles than anything else we've seen so far. And for the pilot that already has the other gear, this is a nice and more compact field monitor solution than the FR Sky version. We've been missing a nice entry level budget goggle for HD Zero, and now we have it thanks to Emacs. Emacs is known primarily for their great bind of flies, and they've been moving on to the digital realm, like the HD Zero Apex 4 inch that they released earlier this year. Now, the new HD Zero goggle has been getting all the buzz, but once you add antennas like this, this setup can go all the way up to almost $700. This costs a third of the price and there is gonna be some compromises you have to make. It may be worth it just to have a field monitor optional. It's funny how products in other segments can have totally different price ranges. This Hollyland Mars M1 wireless monitor actually costs $550, more than double the price of this monitor plus goggle solution from Emacs. That is more of a professional camera to gear type monitor, but it's just funny how the different prices line up like that. So for people that do have the HD Zero goggles, it may be worth spending a couple hundred bucks just so you have a bench monitor or a field monitor that you can go and watch other people fly and troubleshoot your stuff without having to bust out your goggles all the time. Uh, it basically costs the same as the HD Zero VRX unit that you were attaching to your goggles. Unfortunately, it does not have an HDMI 
output so you couldn't use this to feed another set of goggles it even has a tripod mount on the bottom so you could set this up on a little stand and just have a little monitor solution to watch people fly so that other people can come watch you fly in the bag it comes with a usb-c uh hd0 update port and two antennas that's right antennas are included unlike just about every other fpv goggle that's ever been released really nice now these are a pair of linear dipole style antennas so they are budget not going to have the best reception you could upgrade to some true rc stubbies like this for a little bit of money and the reception would be a little bit better I've been really wanting an HT0 field monitor, and this is the solution for me. I don't really need budget entry goggles, but I do need this. And so it's really nice to have one product that can accommodate both ends of the hobby, the hardcore and the new user. And as you progress, if you start out with this, flew for a year and decided you wanted to dive in and spend the extra money to get the HT0 goggles, now you don't have something that's just collecting dust because you can still use it for the field monitor function. Great job. Whoa, I can see into the future. I'm seeing you clicking the like button and subscribe and click the links below. It really helps the channel.